That's Matt. And that's Jeremiah. And we are... So, we've gotten some feedback. We've been told that we need to talk more about ourselves. We love talking about ourselves. Yeah, I, that's kind of weird that that's the feedback that we got. We came up with an idea. Yeah, We're, so you can get to know us a little bit yeah, better. It, I'm going to interview you. And I'm going to interview you. We call this... Twitter view. And we have cards. We do. I did do something a little different this oh, time. Oh, did you? They represent different famous interviews. So we've got Princess Diana. Mm -hmm. We have Frost Nixon, Oprah and Meghan Markle. Uh-oh. One more Oprah interview that is a little bit Oh, less... I knew it. I knew yeah. it. So mine is us. <sighs> and it was our, from our first video. <gasps> I actually think that that's so cool and it's well, annoying. Guess... So you're going to start because you're older and selfish. And this is a good way for everyone to get to know who we are. Yeah. And maybe I might learn something about you. Chances are no. I think yeah, I know everything. I think you know everything about me. What was your favorite vacation? Oh, that's easy. Orlando Studios in 2019. And we spent a lot of time at Harry Potter World. That wasn't me on that vacation. So I really thought you were going to say one of the times we went to Vegas. Oh, are you upset? I'm, I'm actually a little crushed. So what is your biggest pet peeve? I don't like when people say the word "tooken." <laughs> it literally incites so much fury inside me. <laughs> Can you use that in a sentence? Do I have to? I, I kind of wish you would. The payment's already been taken out. What was your most embarrassing moment? Oh my god. My last relationship was very embarrassing. It was a bad one. You knew, you told me every day. <laughs> I needed to leave him, and I was like, I, I love saw. him. These go in order of easiness, I think. Oh, mine don't. Mine are just crazy. Ooh. Tell me about a time when you were the most scared. When I passed my first kidney stone, I honestly thought that I was transforming into a werewolf and that my bones were changing. <laughs> One time you almost got kidnapped when we were little, and I watched it happen with mom and mother. Oh, yeah. <laughs> When was the first time you learned adults are liars? When we were little and we never used to go out. Like mom would take us to McDonald's like once a month because we were poor and had no money. She told us that there was a new restaurant that we were going to try out. And it was, you remember this? And it was called Johnson's Sandwich, Sandwich Bar. Bar. And we were like, what? Johnson's Sandwich Bar? Like we, so we were so excited. Never heard of it. It turned out to be our grandparents' house. His last name was Johnson, yeah. which we should have we were known. So stupid. And we just went to their house and had sandwiches. And then we were like, oh, oh, mom's a liar. Yeah. And she laughed and laughed <laughs> and laughed. What was your best movie theater experience? There might be a couple, but like Cabin mm -hmm. in the Woods is one of them. Just like while you're watching it, the feeling that you got. Yeah. Yeah. We went and saw that movie. I had no, I didn't really know what I was walking into. And then that movie took this huge twist yeah. and it was uh -huh. so... And then I was like, oh, I hope we get to see all the monsters. And then you do. Yeah. Spoiler, oh, spoiler alert. alert. And like people die. Everyone dies. It's yeah. amazing. Mine would be hereditary. Oh, that one too. Yeah, because <sighs> that was, that affected me. That's a good question, by the way. That is, a... you asked it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm complimenting myself. What is your worst nightmare? You dying. It's so legitimately, I once had a dream and it's recurred over and over since <laughs> I'm at your funeral and you're in a casket and they covered up your tattoo you with makeup <laughs> and I'm freaking out at everybody and I'm like, take this See, makeup off. that's very my girl. Because <laughs> I think she does have bonus glasses. Right? Yes. Like, it's my, my biggest nightmare. nightmare of you dying is you being eaten by sharks and it's brutal and it's scary and I don't even look in the nightmare. It does, uh, it reoccurs every once in a while. What was your scariest dream? that I was falling into space and I was surrounded by um, just a bunch of heads of old people and they were floating around me. And then mom's head floated in front of me <laughs> and she was aging rapidly, but then like kissed me on my lips and her head floated <laughs> away. <laughs> what luxury item would you buy if you could afford it? I would buy a boat, a big one. Like a yacht? Uh, yes, it would be like a Titanic sized yacht. It'd have to be bigger than any it should be bigger than that iceberg that just broke off some from somewhere that they say is like six times the size of New York City. What? Yeah, you didn't see that in the news. No. Now we're a news show. <laughs> <laughs> what did you learn about us? Put it in the comments and uh, let us know. Yeah, and if you've got questions for us. Give us questions. Maybe we'll do a Twitter view too and then ask your questions this yeah. time. Yeah.
follow us on Twitter. And subscribe on YouTube. Oh, it's really good. This has been fun. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye, I think. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs>